Hello, hello, hello everybody. Welcome to my knuckery. Um, June's not here today. Um, I'm doing this, making this video, should say, um, because I, um, I've just finished Stephen West's um, surprise sock along for 2024 and I want to share with you. I want to talk to you about the sock and um, the socks and I will show you um, the yarn that I've used and I will show you the socks that I've made. Um, you all know I'm a big big fan of uh, Stephen West's um, I've got quite a lot of his patterns and I you know I think he's just amazing and I, I unfortunately I missed last year's um, sock along for one reason or another and so I was determined this year I was going to do it so wow Stephen you absolutely blew my mind with how these socks came to be they are amazing once I'd done the the first part clue I kind of had an idea where it was going um, but the one thing I can say about Stephen's patterns they um, every pattern has a, a video that you can refer back to um, this this actually um, was lovely to um, take part in. I learned new stitches. I learned how to create a sock from a tube, and um, I just really, really love them. So I will show you my socks, and these are my socks. So I've used botanical yarns, grey. Um, it's a superwash um, merino and uh, nylon combination and then the pops of colour this is purple this is like a, a peach and this is like a citrusy yellow and um, yeah it was just amazing I've done brioche for the heel and um, you had um, options on whether you wanted to do the brioche or you wanted to do another heel and um, then we did short rows I'll show you that just amazing guys if you've not made them um, these are going to be hubby's socks because they're, 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 they're quite too, they're too big for me but um, as you all know I've only got little feet and um, so yeah I, I was just literally wow 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 all the way through um, I learned how to do um, a stretchy bind off and because um, I I make my socks cuff down I've tried the heel I've tried all different heels and um, for me the best heel the best way for me to knit socks is from the cuff down I have done a cutting afterthought heel I don't like that it doesn't sit well on my foot and it doesn't sit on well on Rick's foot so our socks are always um, heel turn flap and gusset and I just love them so kind of I, I, his mind how his mind works you know so you pick your three but the you know kind of and then yet you've got one and two there and then you've got one there and then you've got three here and then you do this here and you do you know so you're in court you're not just using your pops of color once they're all the way throughout the sock so I have got a pair of twins for Rick and I'm absolutely over the moon with them. I will take lots of photographs and put them up on um, Instagram and my Facebook page and not my Facebook page, my own Facebook um, and in the group as well. So absolutely amazing. Unfortunately, I don't know... Um, as I said, this is Botanical Yarns, the grey, what I used. It is a superwash, uh, 75-25 nylon, 425 metres. Um, this is called Cote Lidon Undulata, um, Botanical Yarn. I love Botanical Yarns. And this is what I've got left of the mane. And it's not... Um, 
there's kind of tonals it's quite it's quite amazing how she's dyed this i just love the way um it goes there's hints of dark to light and and, and that brilliant absolutely brilliant and then unfortunately I, these were just minis i had in my stash and um neither i've used them they're going to go in my um i've got um a bag that i'm putting all the sock yarn that I, all the socks that i've made this year all the sock yarn is going into a bag and i'm going to add that to either my um jelly roll or my cozy memories it might even go into the both of them so yeah so that's all i've got left um amazing i know um for me it was just i'm <laughs> just blown away guys absolutely blown away love it absolutely love it so you started with with this tube and you just went from there and just love his patterns there is help throughout and if you get stuck or all you have to do is just email them and somebody at uh, Simon and Penelope will get uh, contact you know contact Stephen and say you know right you know and and they'll get back to them straight away or even the West West Knits group there is a group on there is a West Knits group on Facebook and there were a lot of events it took me a good hour yesterday what finishing the sock I think I just had yesterday I just had that much to do yesterday I finished that the day before I finished that on the Wednesday we got the clues dropped down on Tuesday so I started it Tuesday finished it Wednesday started this Wednesday and finished it yesterday so not quite a July finished um, project but nonetheless have you made Stephen West's opportunity colour opportunity socks if you have let me know and I can um, have a look at yours and um, give me a link or put a link in the comments or or even on the Facebook group let me have a look at yours um, I've, I've seen some of them on West Knits but once I, I I wanted to didn't want anyone to see mine until I'd finished them so yeah so that's all from me for today I hope you all have a fabulous summer um, June and I will be back in September um, and uh, we hope you all have a fabulous summer so anyway guys take care stay safe but more importantly guys be kind to you and we will see you in September happy crafting